Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys all my empties that I have accumulated throughout the last couple months and wanted to share with you guys. So I thought this video would be interesting to show you guys what I've used up and if I'm going to repurchase them or not. So if you guys are interested, then just keep on watching. Also, the star of the show is going to be here with me. So he's just going to hang out with me today. Right, Lucky? So the first thing I want to talk about is my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. This is like my fifth one, I swear. I love this concealer. I know it's overhyped, but it really works well with my skin and it makes my skin under here look flawless. Hides my pores. It's like matte, but just airbrushed looking. So I will be repurchasing this. I actually already did um, as a backup. And this is the shade Light Neutral which I think next time I am gonna go a little bit, a tad bit darker, just because summer's coming and I wanna be a little bit more tan. So I love this concealer and I rave about it all the time. So this I will be repurchasing. The next is a skincare cleanser and this is the Murad Essential C Cleanser. I originally got this in my Ipsy bag and I never really try skincare products from my Ipsy bag just because I have really sensitive skin. And I just can't be trying all these different products because my skin will break out and or get irritated. But I did run out of my Peter Thompson, which I don't have it in here. But that was the cleanser I was using for the past year was the Peter Thompson um, Water Cloud Cleanser, which worked amazing for my skin. But I just wanted to try something different. I just feel like it was cleansing my skin, but it wasn't doing nothing more. So I did try this and I fell in love. Oh my god, I love it. I already repurchased it. So in the future, I probably will repurchase this again until I get tired of it. But as, as of right now, I love it. So next is going to be a moisturizer I used up, which is the Clinique Moisture Surge 72 Hour Auto Hydrator. And this is a gel consistency. I don't know if you can... You can probably see a little bit right there. It's like a gel. And I really did love this moisturizer i did use this like all of 2019 um my only thing though is i went through them so quickly maybe because it's more of a gel form i really did love it i think i bought like 10 of these <laughs> it just kind of sucked though because they are you know a little bit more pricey and i did go through them so quickly so i feel like i was always constantly buying them um but as of now i'm using the keels moisturizer which i've talked about in a previous video and i love that moisturizer because a little goes a long way and i still have so much like it's still a full um jar as of this one i would have been gone by now so this one's nice but i probably wouldn't repurchase this anymore i'm just kind of over it next is going to be a foundation which is the Too Faced Born This Way. This is probably like my 100th bottle, and yes, I already repurchased this. This is my Red or Die. It's really hard for me to try new high-end foundations or just new foundations in general, just because this foundation looks amazing on my skin. I know it's probably different on other skin types, but for me, I have dry skin, and it just looks so flawless, so natural, so skin-like. I really love it, and it matches my, my fake tan pretty well and yes and this is the color golden beige and like i said i already repurchased this i probably will always repurchase this forever <laughs> until something better comes out so this is my ride or die hey what are you doing what are you doing the next beauty product that i used up that i love is this tan lux tanning face drops this is what it looks like it's an oil and it's basically a face tanner and I know this brand has a body oil or a body tanner as well. And I don't know how I feel about a tanning body oil. I don't know how that would apply all over my skin. But as far as my face, I love this. And the reason why I really love it is because when I fake tan, I only tan from my neck down. So my face, when I have no makeup on, is pale. It's white. So I do like these drops because in the morning or when I tan... I'll put a few drops into my moisturizer and apply that all over my skin and then the next day I wake up with a nice bronzy tan face. So it's really nice not to have a white face and brown body when I don't have makeup on. <laughs> so I've been really loving this and I will be repurchasing this. I haven't repurchased it yet because I just ran out 
last night i would recommend this if you're looking for a face tanner this is probably like the best face tanner you can get on the market right now i love this so the next thing i used up was this mario badescu toner and this is the olivera one and i know i did do a favorites video of the fire witch hazel one which that broke out my skin i had to return it and i did purchase a new one of this one just because it worked amazing for my skin it, it didn't irritate it, it didn't dry it out this is for dry and sensitive skin. So this is perfect for me because I have dry sensitive skin. And it's really nice, it cleanses the skin, takes off all the makeup, doesn't dry it out. So I really love this and I already repurchased this. All right, so another beauty product I've used up was this body wash and this is the Oveeno Stress Relief Body Wash. And this is the scent Lavender. I do like this product because my skin is very sensitive. Like I can't really use fragrance on my skin at all. I do have some eczema mildly i don't get it that bad thank god but i do get it on my arms on my legs on my thighs um sometimes here on my neck so for years i was using a fragrance free body wash for years and every time i would try something that had fragrance in it it just always broke my skin out and made my eczema worse so yeah for years i was using a fragrance free and i just got tired of it i got tired of getting out of the shower and smelling like nothing this Luke, did I scare you? I'm sorry. All right, here we are. <laughs> so a couple months ago, I did try this out. This worked so good for my skin. It didn't break me out. It didn't irritate my eczema. It feels so nice when I get out of the shower. I actually have a scent. It's not a strong scent, but it's something better than nothing. <laughs> so I've been really, really loving this, and it lathers really nicely. It smells good. It makes my skin really soft. I really love this brand and I'm going to continue using it for a long, long, long time. I would really recommend this for you. I think it would really work and just give it a try. So I love this. Another beauty product I've used up was the Degree Motion Sense Stay Fresh Deodorant. I have been using this for literally three years. The same scent too. Well, I go back and forth with the scent, but the same brand, the Motion Sense one. I've been using this for three years. I loved it, but now I am using the spray one. And I, I do like it, but sometimes I do miss the powder because I am a hairstylist and when I'm at work and when I'm blow drying, I do get kind of hot and sweaty, <laughs> TMI. So I feel like if I use a powder deodorant, it kind of absorbs all the oil down there. So I don't know, I think I might repurchase this just for when I'm working. I am probably am gonna repurchase this, but I am still using the spray one, so. So the last product I want to talk about is a hair mask and I did mention this in my hair care video and this is the Gold Lust um, Repair Mask which looks like that. It is so beat up. I think I've had this for like a year and a half and I finally finished it. And I did mention in that video that this brand a little goes a long way. So it is pricey but it is worth your money and yeah i really enjoyed this i put it on my hair in the shower let it sit for five to ten minutes rinse it off and i do notice really good results with this mask and i recommend all my clients to get this mask so i love this and i already repurchased it it's in my shower so if you guys are looking for a new hair mask i would recommend getting the orbe one i also really love the old Plex number three which is really good so those are my favorite but I did use this up and I already repurchased it. This is my favorite. Alrighty, so that completes my first empties video. Hopefully this was entertaining or interesting for you guys. If you guys enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to help your girl out. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.